welcome back again to my YouTube channel. This is Kate Cover and this is James Reed. Lu. <laughs> my name is Jetro. I love you, Jetro, and all socials. Yon. Jetro di sukatan tito. Or the go. So itong vlog na to, we're gonna talk about our journey dito sa Dance of Collab. Like how we started, what things did we sacrifice, and kung paano kami napunta dito talaga. Ako nag-start, of course. Uh, lahat naman ito nag-start. It's because of TikTok, I guess. Because we will not be able to um, cast it out without TikTok, first hand. Kasi doon nila tayo nakita or in other social media accounts. But I think uh, for me, uh, it all started when they saw me on TikTok. So, yun, doon nagsimula. Ano bang contents mo sa TikTok? Uh, wala, wala pa po bilang. Pa-cutie. Pa-cutie lang, okay. And then, sumasayaw. That's, that's my main uh, content. But, uh, apart from that, uh, wala, mga hubad before, pero may hindi. Wow! May abs ako dati. Nag-uhubad-hubad <laughs> dati lang. Dati lang, dati. Yun, gawa-gawa lang ng contents hanggang sa makita ng management na I do have the potential. But, uh, going back to the question, sabi mo nga, ano yung na-sacrifice ko prior to the house of Kona? Ako kasi, I, I'm, uh, I'm a teacher by profession. And I'm a licensed teacher. So, what course and what grade? Uh, bachelor of Secondary Education. So, basically, secondary yung tinuturuan ko. Pero, when I was teaching, um, I was teaching elementary because it was, it was a private school. Um, elementary, high school, senior high school, and even college. Because I, I also teach in, in university before uh, that was pandemic. So all of those are just um, online classes. Ah, yes. okay. So online. Ibig sabihin, kapag nakikita ka nila sa screen, Hello, Pogi, well, Sir hindi... Jetro! Hello! <laughs> <laughs> hindi naman sa pagmamayo pa. Hello, pero... pangit! Uh, Bakit biglang kumanon? Hindi naman sa pagmamayamang but I got those compliments. Ay! <laughs> like every day. Like, Ay, every oh day my now. God. Oh my god. Like it's it's kind of annoying sometimes. Totoo ba? Naanoy ka? Feeling ko nabubos yung ego mo kasi ang kapang <laughs> Pero the, the, ano lang, I mean hindi naman sa... Lalo kasi, na ka pag college. Like pag college o pag college. College and high school. College, senior high school, high school, yun, mga ganun. Pero elementary, wala. Hindi naman, kasi mga baby ko siya. Okay, uh, pero yun, oy. Pero yun nga. Eto, may tanong pala ako. Pili ko matatanggal lang ka ng lisensya dito. <laughs> may nagustuhan ka na sa students mo? Ay, wala. Uh, just to be honest. Like, just for a record. College room. Never akong nagkagusto sa student. Uh, kasi, I, I, I'm... I, I'm always trying to, to put my I mean, para alam mo yun. To, to, uh, I'm, I was I, uh, I'm always trying to cage myself. Mm. Na when it comes to students, I need to be a teacher. A teacher, and I know the barriers. Siguro nagaganda maga na, pero I try to to be a professional as always. Kasi yun nga, pero nagawa Pero, uh, hindi ko nililimit yung siyang ko na just a teacher. And gusto ko, I, I also wanted to be friends with them. Because yes. that's uh, one of my strategies as well. To, alam mo yun, parang kunin yung loob nila. Para pagdating sa classroom, they do have respect. And that's uh, one of my ways kung paano sila po. Which is good. Which is, um, ano, uh, alam mo naman ako ba, uh, baka yeah. strategy. prior to the house and pull uh, ano ako eh call center representative saan? pampante so ako yung tipong tao na hindi nagtitigil sa isang lugar I always wanted to to be like um, in one year I wanted to be in Cebu in one year I wanted to be in Manila so saan ka nagtuturo na? saan ka nagtuturo? sa summer sa summer uh, then nagpunta ka ng Pampanga just so you can 
work and as a like call center yeah. representative. And okay. I think now You're I'll gonna... be moving here in Manila for Metro Manila. Why? Because maybe this would be the center of my work. Diba? Who knows? But I hope, I hope so. Pero there are a lot of possibilities here so I wanted to stay in a place where it's going to be convenient for me to travel so isa yun sa mga sinacrifice ko work kasi prior dito as in nagresign talaga sa call center sa call center company kasi nung bata ko I always foresee myself lagi ko sinasabi na I always foresee myself na nandito sa industry na ito. Kahit wala man ako ng ganyan katangkang na ito. Pero I always foresee na, ay, feeling ko para dito na lang sa industry na ito. I mean, in the entertainment industry. That's why I'm here na. Because uh, feeling ko yun yung na-foresee ko before. Which is happy na um, Ayun nga yung sa akin, I stopped talaga na second year college, second step because of financial issues. Parang oh? nag- Yeah, nagkaroon ng financial issues kayo. Dapat, magko-call center din ako. Huh? I was actually, ano, accepted. Ipirmahan ko na dapat talaga yung papers. And dapat pupunta na ako noon. So, yung parang namamagay yung face ko. So, hindi ako pwedeng lumabas. So, that's, that's what happened hanggang sa... Sabi nga sa akin na parang sure na daw na papasok na dito sa Dallas of Colab. Kasi, I was actually really hesitant na baka hindi ako makapasok dito. Kumbaga parang they... I was at the concert as a apprentice. Then parang inisip ko, ay hindi, baka nag-i-invite ako sila influencers or something like that. And hindi pa sure kung makapasok talaga ako dito sa Dallas of Colab or not. Tapos, may option ako to work as a call center agent and join Dallas of Colab. But I chose this path kasi ever since I was a child, talagang mahilig na ako sa TV, sa, sa commercial, yung mga ganyan. Tapos ang idol ko si Marian Rivera. Ganon. So, parang gusto ko talaga yung ginagawa ko to social media, sa networks, and all. So, yun talaga yung dream ko. And I'm pursuing this. Pero yung course ko talaga is psychology. That's not my first choice na course kasi forensic psychology yun dapat but walang forensic psychology sa Philippines so kung tutuloy ko yung pagiging forensic psychologist I'm gonna have to um, study for 10 years ano may plan? kung tutuloy ko yung psych- I mean itutuloy ko talaga yung psychology ko na course ngayon tapos we graduate ako 4 years yun 4 years bachelor's then pwede akong lumipad sa Amerika. Bakit ka tumatawa? Pwede ko siyang lumipad. Pwede akong pumunta sa Amerika to mag-take studies. Yung nasa ko umunod siya ganun. Hi po! <laughs> My airplane! Yeah. Ayun. That's what happened. So, yun lang guys for this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Mag-comment nga kayo kung sino yung gusto nyo makita dito sa vlog. Sa, sa YouTube channel ko. Para makapag-film kami ng vlog. Thank you so much again for watching guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Click the notification bell button para lagi kayo update sa aking videos. And thank you Jet Jet for visiting my YouTube channel. For visiting! For guesting! Thank you so much for watching guys. Always remember that if you can dream of it, you can achieve it. Bye!